So for hundreds of years, artists have been painting almost exclusively on stretched canvas. This is not a good thing because if you think about the last time you went to an art museum, you probably saw a lot of really old famous pieces and if you got up close you would be able to see a lot of cracks going through the painting. This is really common and it's really unfortunate and it happens because canvas is hygroscopic. What that means is it is a material that readily absorbs moisture through the air and expands and contracts based on the environment. Um, with global warming that doesn't help either and we're losing a lot of really famous pieces to environmental changes. So as a solution for that, this company Artifacts came out with a surface that would be resistant to all damages that paintings are prone to. They're called aluminum composite panels. They are designed to never break, never crack, never warp. So if you are a painter that is used to only painting on stretch canvas, getting acclimated to the Artifacts website might be a little intimidating just because they have so many different surfaces to offer. One of the things you can do is order a sample pack. They come in five by seven so you can try out different surfaces. I did like a little eye study just to get acclimated. Otherwise, I'm gonna help you out and I'm gonna show you my two favorite surfaces. These are my top picks. This is the Oleo panel and the Tem panel. The main difference between the two is just surface texture, which is going to reflect your style as an artist. The Oleo panel is going to be really great for really delicate painters because it is very eggshell smooth. It has a lot of slip to it. It's not very absorbent. While in contrast, the Tem panel, its sister, is very velvety smooth and soft to the touch. It's very, very absorbent. It's a lot like painting on Arches oil paper. Probably not as dense, but just as absorbent. The second main difference between the two is temp panel is for multimedia because it is a acrylic substrate. And then oleo panel is lead white, so it is specifically for oil paint only. So that's something you're gonna have to consider if you're used to using like N5 gesso. You can't use it on the oleo panel because it will crack and you will be very upset. I'm hoping this video reaches the right people because if I see another masterpiece being painted on store-bought stretched canvas, I'm just gonna have a meltdown. So painters, give them a try. You owe it to yourself. Okay, glad that helped.